Erie Seawolves, excuse me, are looking to punch their ticket to a third straight Eastern League Championship appearance with a win in tonight's game. Erie Sports Now, Isaac Petcash joins us live from the ballpark to preview what could be another big night for baseball at Erie. Good evening, Isaac. Yeah, hey, good evening, Jameson. We got our number one fan, Joseph, here with us. He's excited. He's got the jersey. He's got the howl towel. Joseph, how do you think the Seawolves are going to do tonight? Pretty good. You think they're going to win? Yes. Who's your favorite player on the team? Do you have one? Carlos Mendoza. Carlos Mendoza. All right, how long have you been coming to Seawolves games for? Quite a while. Quite a while. He's one of the biggest fans here. He's going to be in Section 115 cheering this team on. How do you think? Think the crowd's going to be really big tonight? Yes. All right, we're thinking a Seawolves win too. Hey, Joseph, I want to talk a little bit about the Seawolves and what exactly they can do to win tonight. You know, they had some timely hitting in Tuesday's win against Akron, but not necessarily consistent hitting throughout their lineup. Talk to players after the game on Tuesday about what you this did? team needs. Yeah, I got a chance to talk to a couple of players yeah, about what this that. team needs to do to be able to hit the ball with consistency in game two against the Ducks. At bats were great all night. Like Hicks had some great swings. Melgeri had a couple good swings. Chris had some good swings. Everybody had one, whether it was right at somebody or not. And we didn't have the the necessarily a ton of runs to show for it. But um, with some really good pitchers on the mound for them, we had consistent at bats all night. And 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 we swung the bats well, like you said. You know, we hit some balls hard. Uh, but you know, big blow uh, from 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 Austin Murr. Uh, you know, needed that one big time. All right, ready? Here we go. All right, Joseph, you were telling me during that sound bite something the Seawolves can improve upon. What can they improve upon tonight? They're hitting. They're hitting. How, what, do you, what do you think the score prediction is going to be today? Give me a score prediction. I think we're going to win 36 to 10. That would be something. 36 runs, we'd have a record in a lot of sets. But, hey, maybe it will happen. We've seen a lot of things before. Hey, game time at 635. Seawolves again looking for the split, for the series sweep, excuse me. And if they can win tonight, game one of the championship series would be Sunday here at UPMC Park. Hey, Joseph, do me a favor. Say back to you, Jameson. Back to you, Jameson. All right, all done here. Jameson, back to you.